Hello everyone, LR Shade here, and I am here to do a quick tutorial on getting Diablo 2 to work on newer systems. Um, this is a question that happens a lot in my chat and other Diablo chats, so I figured that I would do this uh, really quick and show you how to get Diablo working. Um, first things first, you actually can get Diablo 2 still from the Battle.net store. Uh, it's both $10, so you can still get them. Um, I would recommend these ones. Uh, there are other sites that do do it for cheaper, but yet buy at your own risk. Um, the other thing is too, is if you do have your CD keys, uh, but you lost your CDs, you can always put them into your account too on Battle.net and you will have them wherever you go and you won't ever have to worry about losing them. So, uh, this was a fresh install of Diablo 2 Lord Destruction, downloaded from Battle.net, so it did come with uh, patch 1.12 and I actually really quick um, got the latest patch 1.13 so this is what it should look like on full screen um, I had no problems getting it to work there's always, there's always a chance. So it seems to be working. Didn't really do much. Some people have problems with frame rate drops, um, but this one seems to be okay for the most part. Beware of demons and beasts. Nice perspective mode. Oh, frame rate drops. There we go. That's dipping a little bit, a little laggy. So, what we're going to do here, save and exit. Um, number, there's actually three things that you should do. Uh, right click on your shortcut, go to properties, three things. Compatibility mode. So, uh, a lot of people actually find a fix for this. If you do service pack two or three, we can try three. Uh, and always tick run as admin. There's a lot of issues that um, people run into with Battle.net or characters not saving or just a number of things, and they do not have run, ad, run as admin ticked. So make sure that you check this, apply, and there's actually one other thing I meant to do. Uh, target line. You want to try and run it as window mode, so you do space, thank you, Avast, dash W, that will put it in window mode. And that's definitely what you want to do. So we're going to hit apply here. Yes, yes we are. Okay. Oh yes. Now, a lot of people complain that this is too small, and you can't actually drag on the sides. But you should. Sometimes this is actually grayed out and you can't actually do it. You can always double click. And we'll scale it. We'll scale it. It's actually great for streamers, so if you are going to be streaming, you can always put on the side here, and then your chat over here. It really works out. That's what I do. Um, so let's test it out again on single player. Should work a little bit better. The only thing is that on your video, you will lose some other things, but uh, it will be a little bit better with performance. So let's see if we're gonna lag a little bit here. Also Beware notice the lower resolution as well, we should probably change. It looks like we cleared out everything before even stepping foot. Great. Help! Help! Help Where me! Where is everything? Help me! Help me! Help! Help me! Help! Alright, that was awkward. Not really choppy at all. You also want to make sure that you pop that open. There you go. Change that resolution. 800 by 600. Doesn't seem choppy at all. Looks good. Battle.net. We actually went to Battle.net. I updated it. The latest patch. It's all good. There's my characters. Seems good. Excellent. What I actually didn't do on this one, and here's another thing that you want to do for Battle.net. Uh, you can actually hit Control M to get rid of that music. Control M. We'll get rid of that terrible, annoying music. 
Uh, and another thing is too, is that we, we see that there's lots of bots on Battle.net still, unfortunately. Um, what you can actually do is type home and a channel name, whatever channel name you want. I forgot actually to do it here. So this will be my home slash home op alargate. So if I actually close out of this and rejoin, it will automatically go to my chat. So you can avoid all of those bots and it helps out tremendously tremendously so that is if you're going to do battle net play and that should be it um usually if you want to change your gateway do it from below here on battle net sometimes when people try and change it up here it doesn't actually work so make sure that you change that down here so we're just going to open it up again make sure everything's running good yes it looks like it's running good Open that up. Looks good. So that is a quick tutorial. We'll just recap really quick. Make sure that you do the dash W for windowed mode. Run compatibility mode for Windows Service Pack 3 on Windows XP and run as admin. Those three things should get your Diablo working. This is a Windows 10 laptop, um, so it should also work on Windows 8 and 7 as well. If you have any questions, comments, please let me know. You can also check me out on Twitch. That's twitch.tv slash LRShade, and you can also like and subscribe if this was helpful for you. Thank you guys.